Last time on the French Prince of Belvedere, that man on TV just said there's a malarkey guy in my house. There's a malarkey here. I must go undercover, boss. Uh, 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 did you think I have a shot with Miss Pelosi? There seems to be another rooster in the hen house. You know me, homos. The name's Jose Brandon. I bet he'd really know how to jimmy my chunga. He's never around when I need him to give me money. Sometimes it sucks. <laughs> Being the president's son. Holy shit. Well, I was born and raised in Scranton, PA. Lifeguard by the pools where I spent my days. Till a dude named Corn Pop, who wasn't that cool, started making trouble at the swimming pool. So I took a chain, wrapped it around my legs. They were ha hairier than my other legs. Not, not my, but black kids would touch them. Come on, man. Then I got on a train and moved to DC. Jarak Jabrama gave a job to me. I shuffled around and sucked fingertips. Made a big speech, kissed the boy on the lips. What are you looking at? I wrote the damn bill. I hold the ladies tight and sniff all their hairs. First person American to fall up the stairs. Ran for president, I was a winner. Winner was me. Now I sit at my desk as a present prendeep. But not, not pre but you know the thing. Come on, get your face out of your ears. Well, guess the only thing left to do is have a sad Jack. You're getting pretty crispy, Jizz Towel. This is probably your last tour of duty. Get ready for an honorable discharge. <laughs> um, what the fuck are you doing? It's in la biblioteca. Get out! mi hermano. Not, not, not hermano. Ay, 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 ay. Get out, Jose. You're ruining my pity party with your surprisingly good music. <laughs> hey, why don't you bend old Jose's ear? My people are known for listening to loud music outside your apartment all day long. Oh, um, I don't know. My dad's a huge dick, and all he cares about is himself, and he does that old man thing where he doesn't know he's farting, but everyone else does? Well, I doubt that's true. Or I very highly doubt that's true. As far as your dad being a pinga, he's probably just wants you to make your own way. No problem. I have crack I can sell for money, and then I can use that money to buy whatever I want. Like crack. Uh... <laughs> The only hard part is getting it out of the White House. I get checked on the reg. Lucky for me, now I have you to mule it out. I wish I could, but I got 55 Bambinos at home. And Poppy promised them he wouldn't move snow no more. <laughs> How about helping me out with a totally different and legit business? Jose Brandon at your cervix. Uh, not, 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 not cervix. You can be the taste tester for my new burritos. <laughs> my gimmick is you don't chew them. You swallow them whole. I call them swallow burritos. My mouth is watered already. <laughs> Delectable. You're all right, Jose. I wish you were my dad. You too, Mama Tambia. You too, me too, Mama Tambia. Keep eating. <laughs> Folks, can we please hurry up and figure out who the malarkey guy is? I have to catch a plane to Poppy's Laugh Hole in South Bend, Indiana. Tickets still available. Let me guess, everyone thinks the black girl did it. <sighs> oh no, another racism. We're leaving. Yeah, I refuse to be judged by half the color of my skin. No one's going anywhere. The answer is clear. Everyone knows that malarkey leads to one thing, murder. And there's only one of us who killed someone. Caitlin is the malarkey. That was Bruce, asshole, and you killed a lady too. That was Chip Rust, an innocent cowboy who was handed a hot gun by a fat little piggy, distracted by her little ticky duckies. 
We did an episode about that on Suits. Speaking of boring shoots, where's Nancy? I saw her pack a keista in Hunter's room with Jose. Ilaria, remember where you're from. Oh, see, si, see, si con Jose. <laughs> Jose with Nancy? Oh, boy, that really fishes up my Coca-Cola. I'll go save her. Oh, I better cover the top of my Coca-Cola. Coming, my love! The malarkey guy could be anywhere in this White House. Let's split up and search. Then come back here for a nightcap, yeah? Yeah. When you're done with that, here are some vegetarian options. <laughs> All right, now it's just a waiting game. You stay here and digest. I'm going to go get a new towel for my... Come. Go get them, pal. Those jabronis deserve a nice soft landing. Tell me about it, stuff. Uh, you easy now there, Nancy. I got chills. It's inflammation. And my liver is quite sore. But there's no stopping this libido. Here we are. I better shape up. Because I need a thing. Do you think, uh, oh, fuck, is it? you drinking sure? Yes, I have and sure down deep inside. You're the girl with the thing. I don't know it. I don't know the song. How much, how much of the fucking music like, all of a sudden do it? Fucking made time. It's awesome. Fucking goodbye song. Mr. President? Mr. President, where are you? Nancy? Nancy? Where the hell are you two? Mr. President? Mr. President, where are you? My God, the president's missing. And perhaps he's busy signing, yes, uh, an important document. No, you fucking idiot. That's not it. He'd be using esign.com, which takes no time at all. Of course. Yes, oh, what a fool I've been. Yes, yes. Uh, he would, of course, be using the safe and easy way to sign a document. Uh, esign.com. We did an episode about Ethan on Tooth. Esign.com, terminating paper. Uh, <laughs> we should find the president. Why don't you just drop your trousers and show Nancy that Lincoln log? You're trying to produce me, Mrs. Baloney. Not, not, not produce. Get, get, get me aroused. Nancy? My word. Hold on, Nancy. <laughs> There's a two-for-one deal in my cabbage patch. Jose Brandon, you've insulted my honor. In the tradition of gentlemen, I challenge you to a duel of physical strength and so forth and so on. What? Let's set some ground rules first. Rule number one. If a gentleman's testicles are all the way on the floor, it, it would be inappropriate to stomp on said testicles. Fair enough. And if a man's ready to surrender, he has to say the name of that guy. What guy? The guy, your father's brother, man. Oh, uncle, yeah, consider it done. All right, enough rules. Get ready for a knuckle sandwich. Well, no, thank you. I just had a bunch of swallow burritos. <laughs> hey, come on, man. Compounding interest. Ooh. Jose Brandon, you have the right to life, liberty, and my shoe up your ass. For the love of all things crypto. All right, Jose, it's time for my Coca Cola nunchucks to diversify your skull. Warren, we can't find the president anywhere. Uh, just relax, everybody. The president's fine. Well, how do you know that? Jose must be the malarkey guy. Oh, my. Give him back to us, malarkey. 
Can somebody please tell me where the Secret Service is? Here's a secret. They don't do anything. <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, the president will clear this up. He'll walk through that door in five seconds. <laughs> One, yeah, two, yeah, three, yeah, four. Hey, over here, everybody. I actually came through this door. Oh, thank God, Mr. President. Wait, where'd Jose go? Jose, I bet he's cleaning under my desk. Those people never stopped working. Great guy, by the way, Jose. Definitely not the malarkey guy. <laughs> hey, everybody, it's me, Jose. <laughs> All set? Just to check then? You okay, Jose? Oh, yeah, never better, actually. I feel like I could run a marathon. You ever go for a run? Running's fun. No kayak. Slow down. Get down. He's going to blow. We're gonna sleep everybody back in time today. This is time, Mr. Rizzo. Yo, hello, me homos. The name's Jose Brandon. I'm a Mexican that son of a bitch. Board. I'm a love maker, a life taker, and daily. Hey, you think you could steal my awesome undercover boss idea, man? What? What gives? Huh? You heard me, pal. What are you doing in my clothes, man? What? Why you me, man? Who? What? You what? That's what I said, pal. What? Huh? Huh? Who are you, man? I'll tell you who I am. I'm Jagak Jagagos, precipice of the United States. And you're under arrest for being the malarkey guy. Take him away, boys. Hey, easy now. Come on, man, I'm, I'm, I'm the guy. Yay, Mr. President! Yeah, he did it! He got the Milwaukee! <laughs> Pepper girl. Fucking Mexicans. Fucking knew it. Fucking Mexicans. Why can't every government agency be like the Secret Service? Here's a secret. They give a damn. <laughs> this better be good, old man. I called you down here, son, because I found these in the toilet. Those do not look familiar. <laughs> I want to go into business with you. I'll give you the money and you make these and sell them. 50-50. Deal? Thanks, Dad. I love you, Dad. I love you, son. To the moon and back. I hope, we don't, I don't hope that's unnecessary. But it'd be very hard to do that. But I, I, I hope I would do that. If you're all cool with it, I'm going to go have a happy Jack. Good work, everyone. All is well. No, it's not, sir. You put Jose Brandon, who's you, in a Guantanamo Bay jail cell for the rest of his slash your life. It's called solving a problem. Fucking guy that doesn't even know what's going on. Sounds like a bunch of old Donkey Kong. Hey, Nancy, will you go to the sock hop with me? How about I just jerk you off in the sky car? Oh, boy! Don't worry, I made sure all the flight logs were deleted by accident. Did you guys know Olivia Newton and uh, John died last year? Uh, she's a shame. She's a, she's a, she's a sweet lady. 